check out this baddie of a phone, folks. The T-Mobile Revel 5G is here. And T-Mobile isn't playing with their branded device. We're talking a mid-range phone trying to reach the premium standard. Oh, and it's also, as mentioned earlier, 5G capable. Has T-Mobile got it? Check out this overview by Joy the Snapper. Well, here we have it, folks, a beautiful full HD Revel 5G from T-Mobile. They're pushing this device. The Pixel 4a was not released for T-Mobile as of the making of this video, but they are releasing a couple of phones, including the Revel 4, Revel 4 Plus, and their premium model of the three, the Revel 5G. So speaking of the Revel 5G, T-Mobile does want you to know some specifics, so we're going to show you those specifics real quick. 5G, baby. Seamless HDR streaming, next level stereo speakers, you have the surround sound speakers, you have Bluetooth, what they call Super Bluetooth, you have the Snapdragon 7 series, which gives you the 5G connectivity, you have a 4500 milliamp battery that reverse charges, incredible, you have true to life visuals with a 90% screen to body ratio, 6.5 inch plus full HD display, true to life colors, HDR 10. Advanced triple camera system, a macro, wide angle, and a high res 48 megapixel Sony camera. What do these cameras do? They give you 10 times digital zoom. You have the macro camera giving you the micro details, and you have the 8 megapixel super wide angle, plus a super night mode for brighter shots in low lights. Records smooth 4K videos with optical image stabilization and records 960 frames per second. A 16 megapixel front camera gives you the best selfies you can get on a mid-range device, they claim. The power button to the side lights up, super cute. And then you have that fingerprint scanner in the back. You have a 2.5D glass design, so it feels nice in your hand. You also have Face ID access. You don't want to use the fingerprint scanner in the back. But that's a quick overview of what this phone does. With that being said, let's look at specs. We have this beautiful Revel 5G right here, 6.5 inch display, 90% screen to body ratio. We have a beautiful back, very nice glass. Glass-like material. Which is beautiful. It's like a matte glass. You have like a beautiful pink gloss to it, literally screaming T-Mobile branding to you. We have that beautiful fingerprint sensor right in here. You have that beautiful, uh, little grill camera situation very similar to what the google pixel and the iphones have you have that 48 megapixel sony sensor right in there and you have the other two cameras the macro camera and the um other camera for the wide angles you have that front facing camera as well up in here with that hole punch display and then you have that full hd 6.5 inch display it's basically stock android it's very close to it gives you a very simple experience for users that don't want too complicated of a system too much um bloatware you don't want any of that it is pretty quick, it's pretty snappy, much faster than the Rebel 4, and it does have a higher resolution display, so everything looks prettier. So speaking of specs, let's go back to that. So specs, we're talking about a 6.5 inch plus display, camera of a 48 megapixel camera, with an 8 megapixel ultra wide, and a 5 megapixel macro camera, which gives you more detail in those already beautiful 48 megapixel photos. Front facing camera, 16 megapixels, beautiful for those selfies. Battery life, 4500, runs Android 10, Display is 6.5 inch as mentioned. You have six gigs of RAM, which is pretty moderate for a mid-tier device in 2020. Incredible 120 gigabyte internal storage, the highest in a Rebel phone yet. An expandable via micro SD chipset. You have the Qualcomm Snapdragon 765 octa-core, which gives you that beautiful 5G connectivity. You have the six gigahertz 5G bands, sub six gigahertz, and you have that fingerprint sensor. So you are gonna get a 5G connectivity, the nationwide 5G that T-Mobile does offer. So there you have it, folks. That's a quick run through and overview on the Rebel 5G. Any more questions, let me know in the comments below. And not only that, let me know, are you gonna get this beautiful budget premium 5G device? To be quite honest, we're starting off at a $600 price or less, or was it 300? Maybe even less than that. If you go to a T-Mobile store, this is the cheapest entry 5G device as of the recording of this video. Please let me know if this interests you. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Will you be getting the Rebel 5G? Will you be getting a Rebel product? Let us know. And as always, please like, share, subscribe. It really helps to keep these videos going. And I hope you have a great and wonderful day.